Hey everyone, Katie and Alex here to get you up to speed on everything happening around and inside Verizon. Southeast VP of Retail Sales and Operations Kwame Trotman is in Lumberton, North Carolina with an update on the relief efforts in front of our Wireless Emergency Command Center, which is brought in to support the area. We're right here in, um, at the Lumberton store where we did see some impact from Hurricane Florence. Uh, great, great news is that we did reopen the store um, on Monday. Um, we've gotten um, a lot of the community members is coming up to our WEC, you know, charging their phones. Um, we're getting a lot of inquiries about coming onto Verizon's network. So thank you for the network team for making sure that we are up operational and sustainable, unlike some of the other providers in the neighborhood. Um, our employees are, you know, very, very um, they're safe and sound. Um, a lot of them have came back to the stores. Um, we had an opportunity to go and meet and greet um, many of our teammates uh, that's, that's here, you know, representing the brand. We did drop off some materials. Uh, we dropped off some water. We dropped off some, some snacks um, throughout the day. Um, I, I, I'm just very, very proud of the way that we've been able to uh, show up and really stand out for um, not only our employees, but also our customers. Talk to you later. Thanks, Kwame. For the next few days and even weeks, that community is going to need our help. Jordan Henderson, a solution specialist from Fayetteville, North Carolina, knows why it's important to be there for our customers. I mean, a lot of us, I mean, we can definitely empathize because we're going to do the same exact thing. So it's easy for us to understand, like, this is a terrible thing that's happening, but we're going to do everything that we can, everything in our power to make it as easy and as easy a transition as possible to help you get back on your feet, whatever it is that we can do. And running to a crisis is nothing new here at Verizon. In fact, it's something we do every day and everywhere. Like just last week when Solutions Specialist Steve Mann and General Manager Don Palacci ran to the scene of a car accident outside their store in Cicero, New York. Steve quickly pulled the customer from a burning car. Then both Don and Steve helped the woman escape her vehicle that was turned on its side. Northeast VP of Retail Sales and Operations Manny San Pedro showed up in Cicero to thank the duo for their heroic efforts. And a team of Chris Mundorf, John Popolski, and Ernie Berthold delivered and set up a tactical command center in Lawrence, Massachusetts to assist in the gas line explosion recovery efforts. So as you can see, when communities we serve are in need, we respond. Very true. You know what else we do really well here at Verizon? Celebrate diversity. Now through October 15th, we're celebrating Hispanic Heritage Month by putting a spotlight on the culture and contributions of the Hispanic community. Our theme this year, Unidos, we are stronger. Me da orgullo ser parte de una compañía que no solo celebra la diversidad, sino también valora y aprovecha nuestras diferencias. Ese es el poder de la inclusividad. Cuando todos unimos nuestras capacidades y trabajamos juntos, podemos lograr resultados fenomenales. Que lo disfruten. Couldn't have said it better myself. Keep an eye out for some exciting events and ways we plan to celebrate throughout the month. All right, that'll do it for us today. Be sure to follow us on social for all the latest updates on everything happening around and inside Verizon. Until next time, you are up to speed.